What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Batman Arkham Asylum. Last episode was pretty intense. As you can see, there's a lot of dead bodies on the floor because uh, we went to town. Okay, so we pretty much got captured by the Joker and friends. And then we had a little bit of a trip with, with Scarecrow. And obviously, well, we're fighting skeletons, but it was all in our mind. And in reality, we're actually fighting these individuals that are now dead. Thank you very much. Uh, so now we're, we're going to proceed here with the story. We should be coming to an end almost. I want to say this is the elevator from the beginning of the uh, the series, the game. And there he goes. The same elevator that we brought the Joker in in the first episode. Oh, I already see where we have to go. Yeah, this is pretty much just tracing our steps from the beginning. So you can see, yep, yeah, exactly. I don't know how to explain it, but I know what I'm saying. Okay, so I don't know. I'm assuming we can glide here. Please tell me we can glide. <laughs> I was in midair, and I thought we were going to die. Hold on, let me switch back controls. Okay, so we have... Here we go. What do we have here? Alright, so we have to go up there. Okay, yeah, this is, uh... What the hell? There's a bunch of pictures of Batman. And other people, and cameras, and blueprints, and... It's kind of crazy. There's a bunch of skeletons on the wall. Okay, is this supposed to be, like, some sort of, like, secret little dungeon here? Because... I don't know if we could do anything here, really. Okay, that was weird. I'm a little bit intrigued as to what the hell was the purpose of that. How about over here? Man, what? Were we really not even supposed to come here? Is this really a waste of time? Yeah, probably. It, it probably was. Just saying. Yeah, the bad guys are going to be right over. <laughs> it was a waste of time, man. Okay. Right, here we go. Hello, friends. You do not know it yet. But you're about to meet your destiny. And it ain't looking too hot, man. Be quiet. Yep. Sorry, Bucko. I had to I had to I had to pretty much uh stun the first dude that had a gun because they're pretty much the most dangerous ones. You want some of this? Yeah, I want some of this. <laughs> I don't know what I did to him, but I kicked him some way, shape, or form that just made him <laughs> go to sleep. Pick up the interview tape. Harleen Quinzel. Mm -hmm. Call me Harley. Everyone does. I'm surprised you want to intern here at Arkham. I've always had a thing for extreme personalities. You can't deny there's an element of glamour to these super criminals. I'll warn you right now. These are hardcore psychotics. Most would rather kill you than speak to you. I'm sure I'll be fine, Doctor. They'll eat you for breakfast. I mean it. One or two of them will enjoy it, too. Be careful. Only if you knew that she's just as crazy as they are. But apparently it's too late now. Okay. What do we have here? Another one of these little thingy-majiggies. Okay. Was it here or was it this one? No, it was this one. Okay. Here we go, boys. Now, these do have a timer. But we have to be extra quick with it. Oh. Alright, good. One more. Come on. Ah! There we go. 
Those always come so close. I don't really know what happens when the timer runs out, but just feels always like I'm so close to not getting it on time. Okay, so I'm assuming we go back now. The elevator has been opened. That's pretty much where Scarecrow went, right? See, this is the first elevator from the first episode that pretty much damaged it. Came crashing down and... That got me out. Yeah, me too. I'm going down here anyway. the ball let him walk around. Just another distraction for the bat. Suits me fine. What do you mean? If the bat is looking for Scarecrow, he's gonna It's the bat! It's the bat! Hello, boys! Oh, what is that? I wonder what that could be. Ah. Uh. Well, you know, unfortunately for you guys, I have night vision or thermal vision. I, I really don't know what to call this, but it's some type of vision. You okay, buddy? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, they're getting guns. That's what that was. That was a freaking... It was a freaking safe for, for guns. I thought it was supposed to be like some type of alarm or something. Well, it doesn't matter anymore. He's not dead. Look at this guy. <laughs> he looks like he's on timeout. That's pretty epic. Okay. The body mechanics are a little funky. Obviously, this is a pretty old game. But I'm, I, I must admit, it is getting pretty good. And it's it's really fun. Alright, Scarecrow. Where are you, buddy? I have a feeling we're going to go somewhere else before we go to Scarecrow. My name is Dr. Gretchen Whistler. Do you understand me? Yeah, I hear you, bitch. So when's dinner? <laughs> I'm getting hungry. <laughs> what the hell? <sighs> Damn, man, I thought this was supposed to be rated PG. I actually don't know the rating of this game. But I don't like it. I don't like the fact that there's a lot of skeletons here. Um, okay, I have a feeling. Oh, Lord. I have a feeling this is not good. Oh, those are Ivy's plants. Too late, Batman. One step closer, and this goes into the water. The cave will fill with your deepest, darkest nightmares, and you will never reach your precious venom roots. <laughs> Don't do it, Crane. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh Lord! Gain access to Killer Croc's lair via intensive treatment. Dude, I thought they were supposed to be on the same side. <laughs> it's about literally just okay. Man just literally came up from behind him, and uh, well, he was pretty much gonna eat him, but Batman came to save the day. Because Batman, not only does he save. His friends, but he saves his enemies too. Right? What an idiot. I know. I completely agree. Okay, so. Do not. Hey! Shh, damn, that actually scared me. Yo, what the fuck? Danger, keep out. Is this intensive treatment? Intensive? Okay, what's over there? Let me see. Is there anything over here? That is the question. Batman, can you hear me? Have you found Croc's lair yet? I'm close to Croc's lair. I'll contact you when I have more information. This is where I was on the other side of the door. 
Yeah, that's that's exactly where I was. He kind of he gave us like a little bit of a jump a jump scare, and then we had to go the other way. I remember now. Okay, just wanted to come here and make sure there's nothing extra. You know. All right. Oracle, I'm heading into Croc's lair to collect the plant spores Ivy spoke about. He's in some kind of old sewer network. Send me the schematics. It's like a maze down here. There's nothing on record. Bruce, are you sure about this? Sounds like a suicide mission. I've got no choice. I've tuned the scanner to detect the spores required to make the antivenom. It'll lead me straight to them. What about Croc? Croc's just an animal. And animals just need traps and the right bait. I'll be fine. I'll contact you when I'm done. What a savage. Man, I would have been so scared. But not him. Batman don't care. What, what, what do you mean he's just an animal? These floating platforms will support me. But will also send sound waves through the water, giving away my position to Croc. I'll need to move as slowly as possible. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Hello? Rock. Behave yourself, friend. Oh, crap. Behave yourself, please. Don't do anything that's gonna scare me because I don't like scares. I literally never thought I'd be scared to play a freaking Batman game, if I'm being completely honest with you guys. But I am borderline creeped out here. <laughs> What's going to happen next? Do, 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 do. Ah. Oh. oh. Okay, we're on top of a platform. Okay, we should be good. Okay. Rock. Come on now, man. Jesus Christ. I'm just gonna walk. I'm not even that scared anymore. I'm already kind of used to this. If I'm being completely honest, I'm no longer scared. I am no longer scared. And we're almost there, which probably means there's gonna be a jump scare. Please, please. Is the entire passageway literally like this? Like, does it have to be like this the entire time? Oh, God. Okay. Ah, oh, you ain't that bad. You ain't that bad. That's it. Wait, where am I? Where am I supposed? Nope. Oh, this way? Here we go. <laughs> I can taste you already. Hey. Hey, Croc. Calm down, Croc. Calm your ass down. Okay, where am I supposed to go now? Wait, what? Hmm. Could it be this way? So I have to go to where... Oh, it's right here, dude. Wow, I'm an idiot. Alright, gather the spore. Ugh, nasty. These spores don't contain enough of the antivenom mold. I'm going to need to find more. Jesus Christ. So I need to find like four more, dude. This is unreal. Okay. Let's keep going. It's okay. Okay. It's okay. He's not even that dangerous anymore. I'm already used to this. Why am I even walking? I ain't scared. A little bit more. Gotta fill up the entire test tube, I would assume. 
So I need like three more. Okay. Okay, whoa. Alright. That was close. I'm assuming when it comes to Croc, the only thing we can do is run away. Or, well, not run away precisely, but avoid him. Or make him avoid us, or make him just... What I'm trying to say is, I don't think we can actually fight him and kill him. <laughs> Nerd. Get that ass out of here. Okay. Forgot how to turn around. Okay, what? Oh, shit! Holy crap! Christ, this is getting spooky bad. I don't want a part of this. I don't want any of this. There's another spore over there, right? We, got, we gotta get. We gotta finish this. Oh no! <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so things are getting slightly more intense. I think I need an upgrade here. Uh. How about uh, a nice little quick upgrade for your boy? Yeah. Armor upgrade. Now I got more health. Yeah, that's very well needed. Look at this, man. Look at this fucking bunch of food just hanging around here. Dude, it comes so close. Holy crap. I'm assuming that had to happen in order for him to break this wall. So I can be able to collect the spores. Alright, I think we might need like two or three more. Yep, he's gonna come from there. Holy crap. Holy crap, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> He's coming so close. By the way, where the hell is Scarecrow? I mean, I know he took him underground, but where, where the hell is he? And the funny thing is, I know he doesn't die because when we played The Dark Knight. Which, by the way, let me know in the comments if you still would like that into a series. Find you, Batman. But when we played The Dark Knight, Scarecrow was like the main villain. So I want to say he does not die, and if he dies, he probably just comes back. Or something, I don't know. Okay, here's the other one. Alright, good. I literally think we need, like, two more. Or not. You are my oh, no. Wait, what? Oh, God. Floating wooden platform. Whoa. Whoa. Did he just jump out of the water like a crate? Whoa, whoa. Whoa! What was that? Run to escape. Fuck. In the pontoon, you are on. Oh, so if it starts to, to to shake, I gotta run from there. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for the heads up, bro. Guess guess it's almost impossible not to die. <laughs> Holy crap, dude! Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy, holy. Crap. Oh my lord. Yeah, this this is actually pretty intense. I will feast on your bones. Not gonna lie. Croc is actually pretty intense, but I like this. It's, it's actually something a little different. I already got your whole game planned out, bro. You ain't doing nothing with an F. Nothing. 
You know what that? Holy crap. Yo. I'm a, I'm a fucking heart attack, dude. Okay, I know it's gonna he's gonna come out of here. Oh, I know he's gonna come out of here. came from the side. Oh! <gasps> this man actually came from the side. <laughs> Holy crap. You, Shut your ass up, crocodile. At the end of the day, you're just a crocodile. You're really nothing special, right? So... You only speak I've when I've got enough spores. I need to get back to the bat cave and formulate the antidote. Wait. Oh, I get it. You've activated a sonar beacon down there. Clever. Hmm. Of course, Oracle, clever. I'm getting out of here. What about Croc? He won't be a problem. <laughs> Dear Lord. Oh dear Lord. Yo, this man is annoying, dude. I gotta get the hell out of here. I I can only imagine as a little kid playing this. I would totally shit myself. Shut your ugly ass up. He's like a grown little kid. Or an oversized baby. To some extent. I don't know. It's it's kinda weird. I said shut up, man. Okay, I, I ain't that scared anymore. I ain't that scared anymore. Holy crap. Holy crap. Alright. We got this. We got this. We have got this. Your flesh will tear. It's part of the game. It's part of the game. It's part of the game. Dude, honestly, Bruce, he is... He's a savage. Oh. I mean, this man is not nervous whatsoever. I mean, he's just walking on top of wood, just hanging out, doing his thing. Just another day of work. Super calm. Whoa, wait. I would be shitty myself, and I mean, I am, and I'm not even in the actual game. I'm only playing it from here. Dude! Dude, 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 chill. Holy crap. Oh my lord. My caves will be your tomb. Hey, hey, what do you mean? Actually won that? Oh. <laughs> I will find you. <laughs> I actually won that. Holy crap, return to the back end for the to formulate the anti-tiny compound. Ooh. Alright, well this ain't that bad, bruh. Alright, let's go back. 
Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie. That was the most nerve-wrecking boss fight or boss encounter that I've had in this game so far. Unbelievable. You know what's funny though, those little, I've realized that those little mouthpieces actually kind of guide you in a way. Yeah, I can just keep upgrading my armor, dude. What? Holy crap, dude. It's pretty massive. Okay, so I'm assuming we have to go this way. Well, never mind. They don't really. Not down here. Joker says the bat's got a storeroom or a cave or something down here. No way. Joker says he's getting his toys from somewhere. Makes sense, I guess. Down here, yeah. Alright, here we go. Take the guy out with the guns first, man. <laughs> oh, Lord. Batman is not fucking around, man. Oh, shit. Oh, wait. He picked up the gun? I don't know. He can pick up the gun, too. What the hell? I'm not gonna lie. I'm a lot more comfortable now that I got more health than I did before. Before I just couldn't. Alright, so this is definitely the right the way. I take it you felt that. The plants are going crazy. I'm getting seismic spikes in all locations. It's not good. It's okay. I've got the mold samples. I'm heading to the Batcave to mix up the antidote. Good. i tell you to hurry, but I'm sure you know what you're doing. Contact me in the cave if you need anything. Alright. Back to the cave we go, boys. Oh, the cave's actually right here? Wait, what? This is relatively close. Scan and open. Lord, I want a cave like this, man. This is a true man's cave right here. Jesus Christ, Batman. Why are you so cool, dude? Can you be my dad? Can you please be my dad? Um, I forgot how to go over there. Did I have to get like... No, that wasn't it. Uh... Did I have to jump? I, this is probably going to be something really stupid, and I'm, I'm really going to feel dumb when I do do this. Uh, wait a minute. I, th I think I can actually go up there. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap. I probably could just jump. Like, honestly, I, I could probably just jump over there, but I don't remember, so I don't want to risk it. You see, like, right now, like, I, I can't even control the damn guy. Sure. Close. It's been more difficult than I expected. The process is slow, difficult, and doesn't produce much antidote. And the good news? The chemical will definitely stop Ivy. It may also reverse the Titan transformation. I need to run some more tests to be sure. I've set the computer to create more, but I need to get out of here and find Ivy. Thank God. Her plans have reached the Gotham River. Best man. The ultra back claw upgraded back claw attachment fires the three hooks at one time. Additionally, leverage allows additional leverage allows structural weaknesses to be pulled down remotely. 
Holy crap. Well, ain't that a type of weapon? It's looking good, man. All right, guys, we're gonna end it here. We actually saw, saw Poison Ivy from destroying the island. Obviously, we're gonna do that next, but we actually finally, I saw a lot of the comments from you guys. I, yes, I do read the comments, believe it or not. I saw a lot of comments saying, wait till he gets to the croc. He's gonna freak out. And uh, you guys were right. You know, that, that, that was pretty cool. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. I think we literally have like two or three episodes left, and uh, we should be done with this game. So far, it's been great. It's actually getting really good now, and I'm enjoying it a little bit more now. At the beginning, it was a little bit slow. Uh, but nonetheless, it's been enjoyable.